joined with women's head soccer coach Greg Painter after their 5-0 victory against Mount St. Mary's here at the Tiger Soccer Complex, improving to 4-2-0 and on the season. Now, Coach, first of all, what were your thoughts on the game? Well, I, I thought we played really well. I mean, the, the situation was that you know, we had a, a game on Friday night that we were able to, to win, so we were coming up with a lot of confidence. And it's been, it's been a real emotional week for our team. And so it, it was nice to, to be at home and to, to really get off to a fast start against a, you know, a Mount St. Mary's team that you know, had beaten us last year. And we were really uh, trying to write that, that, that concept to make sure that we were on the, the winning end today. Now, Cheyenne Skidmore this season has been playing lights out. She got her first multi-goal multi -goal career, game of her career today, scoring two goals. Talk about her play, how important it's been uh, in these back-to-back -back wins for you. Well, Cheyenne's been in, you know, she came in in incredible shape this year. And so, you know, she's off to a really fast start in our non-conference uh, slate. But, you know, she's she's been our, our probably our most effective forward at, at breaking teams down. And, uh, you know, what she's doing isn't just scoring. She's, you know, contributing with assists. But she's really, um, you know, been our, our mainstay in terms of what she's doing offensively just to, to break break defenses down and give us opportunities. Now the play, the whole team has been there, especially uh, Emily Baines scoring a goal in four straight games. The freshman Sophia Reed has a goal in back-to-back -back games. What has contributed to, to this offensive onslaught you guys have had? Well, I, I think it's the fact that we have a varied attack. We have more than just one person that defenses can can uh, key in on. And, and when you have that, it's, it's really opening up the whole field for us. And, you know, we, we have you know, Sophia and Caitlin Brooks has now contributed a couple of goals throughout the season. So we're really getting that pressure on, on defenses, and that's going to just give us opportunities that are all over the, the penalty area. Now coming up, you guys are facing a five-game road trip to close out the end of the month. Um, you're going to see the likes of NC State, Campbell, and then after that you're going to open up your CAA play. Uh, what, how are you guys going to prepare for this grueling road trip coming up? Well, I mean, th this weekend when we go down to North Carolina and play Campbell and NC State, it's going to be very similar to what we do in conference where we're on the road you know, on a Thursday night through through Sunday. So it, it's going to be, um, you know, a test for our team. We haven't had a road trip like that. And, and obviously playing two good teams in Campbell and NC State that are off to great great starts this year. So it, it, we're going to use that as a as a foundation for what we do in conference play. And obviously we start off down in Williamsburg to play William & Mary and Old Dominion. So, um, you know, the non-conference is just supposed to prepare us for, the not, for our conference schedule.